What's going on everybody? My name is Chris and I am here today in this little house. Yeah. It's not really a house. It is. Oh man. Welcome to Toast's Free Stuff Poria. Why do people always put their sides so freaking high in the sky I can never read them? <laughs> uh, take whatever you like from the surrounding chest. Donating or donations of iron, gold, and diamonds are appreciated. Okay, let's donate into this chest. Let's donate nine iron ore. And Corster, great. Just can't stand your chest. Ha <laughs> ha! I actually don't have anything. I can give him the shovel. Do you want the shovel? Here you go. Is gonna go to a hopper? Oh no! I'm just kidding. Uh, okay, I wonder if that will come back to me. Uh, so just, I just, I just, I'm not really here to steal any of this crap. Well, it's not really stealing. It's free stuff. I'm just kind of here to check it out. Uh, carrots. Look at all those foods. Uh, carrots. Ooh, seeds. Baked tatters. Actually, I'm gonna take a stack of that because I could use it. Uh, whoa. Oh, I thought it was a wood. Ooh, I'll leave it. What's this? Ink sacks. Oh. Well, actually, I will. Well, uh, let's leave a half stack. <laughs> Ink sacks are a rare commodity. I don't know if I'll ever use it, but I'm taking it. <laughs> To do viewing platform, yeah, like that's simple. So, um, yeah, I was just checking it out. I, I don't know why I necessarily started the episode there, but yeah. Um, welcome everybody. My name's Chris. Welcome to another episode of Unoriginal Craft. Woo! For the third episode in a row, <gasps> we're gonna be working on the arena. Yay! Yay! Ow. Um, the last two episodes were actually recorded uh, a day after each other, like. I record it, and then the next day I recorded the next one, and this one's being recorded after that chunk. Is this it? what? Rip hippo forestry forest. Dun dun dun! Look at that floating tree over there. So flo oh, it's not floating anymore. So uh oh, what's this? Get gravel. Oh, got gravel rock. Oh, thanks rock. Yeah, I'll actually leave that in there for now. I'm not actually entirely sure if I need gravel. I did say two videos ago that I need gravel. Okay, I was really. What's that? Whose horse is in here? Is there, is there a thing? Roman! The heck, Roman? How'd you even... What? How? Okay, you don't have any damage on you. That's great. The heck? I think this is Kenny's horse? Or, sorry, Zello's horse? That, that is her, her name, right? I, I forget. Uh, Kenny actually is going by a new... Ilias, I guess uh, you, you could call it, uh, by Zello. She wanted to rebrand her channel, and she got a new channel, and I'm getting millions of texts. Uh, huh. Okay, I might have to pause the episode here a second. Why is this, why is, this, why is that not growing? That's a random thing to not grow. Um, today, we're going to be getting rid of this. I'm going to mark this, actually, with some... Iron ore! Wait, oh, I did have it in my inventory. Iron ore! Yeah! I can break this finally. Uh, uh, yeah, we're gonna be putting the middle together in this episode. What is the middle? Well, I don't know if I censored out the last episode or not when I went to the creative world. I don't. I never understood these messages. <laughs> it's a mystery who sent these. Uh, I don't think it was ever revealed, unless they posted it in their episode and I just missed it, and then in which case, well, my life sucks. So, you were going to be building the obstacle in the middle, yay, no one knows what it is, maybe, I, I don't really freaking know. Uh, yeah, I should have probably brought some blocks down here, but I got all excited from the gavel. Um, yeah, so, yeah, two episodes ago I said I needed gravel, but I decided I don't think I'm going to use much coarse dirt. I mean, I might still sprinkle sprinkle it around, but I don't I don't really know how much of it I could use. So I appreciate it, Rock. It's freaking awesome. They got me gravel. But if you want a background, if you have another use for it, you can take it. But then again, I guess it is kind of rude to reject a gift, and I could probably put it to use with other things. But I mean, if he's giving it to me for the community project, then you can feel free to take it back if you think you could do something else with it. Um, but uh, if you're donating it to me simply to get the help get the arena done then if you want you can take it back uh what am i looking for here uh first i should actually probably organize my inventory a little bit but you know why would i do that when i could just freaking freaking mash everything in 
do as many chests as I can and freaking be super unorganized. So, um, my sister is in the hospital right now. Uh, my mom's actually in town. And actually, I should keep those taters. Uh, yeah, my mom's in town and uh, we're hanging out at the hotel room with her, with our my mom, my sister, my mom's boyfriend, and my girlfriend. When all of a sudden my sister started acting a bit strange, we were playing Mario Kart 8. And my sister was acting pretty strange and we weren't entirely really sure why. And then she started complaining about having cramps. And then they got worse and worse. She sharded, she shart, she sharded, yeah. That, that's the entire issue here. She sharded. I probably shouldn't joke about this. Um, she started um, uh, getting really gross, icky feeling. And she ended up getting sick. She started shaking. She could barely talk. She couldn't really walk. This is all in the span. Like this, She went from just feeling fine to just terrible in the span of like maybe 10 minutes. It's pretty bad. And she had a pain in her pelvis. So, at the time of recording, it's actually, <laughs> I'm actually recording this at 2.30 a.m. This actually might be the latest I've ever recorded anything, ever. Ooh, actually, I'm going to need these stairs. Stairs? No, not those ones. Th those ones. I'm going to take more cobbles as well so I can construct more stairs. Uh, but yeah, at the time of this recording, it's actually 2.30 a.m. She went to the hospital around, I want to say, 10-ish. And they're keeping her overnight. They took blood. Um... We're pretty convinced that it's appendicitis, which, oh man, I don't know, is that how big I wanted this? I wanted it, I wanted this to be 5x5 five five around the center. Oh, you know what, actually, before I do this, I forgot to take the screenshot for last episode, so I'm going to come over here real quick, and <laughs> you guys could see, you guys could see some behind the scenes. I need a good spot. This is the best spot to take a screenshot from. Of my progress, maybe probably from up here, wouldn't it? Whoa, it? So behind the scenes, how to make a thumbnail? How do Minecraft YouTubers do it? Ah! Uh, <laughs> I don't know what that noise was. Let's right, just go up here. Let's see how this looks. Uh, I guess that's okay. Did I do it? I did it! Yay! Now you guys can see when this is recorded. Um, I've, yeah, I haven't released the second episode yet, if I haven't talked about that yet. But yeah, oh, oh. Um, but yeah, so, my sister was, went to the hospital. My sister's boyfriend, who is, my sister's boyfriend's mother, I should say, is a doctor, and I, Sarah talked to her, and she's convinced that it's appendicitis. Um, uh, my mom's pretty convinced it's appendicitis, and my girlfriend's mom is also, uh, thinking it's appendicitis. Uh, my, my girlfriend's mom works in a doctor's place. Uh, I don't, I, I don't really remember exactly what she does. Okay, I need to figure out how to... I need to make... Four. Five. Right? And... One, two, three, four, five. Oh, that's, yeah, that's not right already. I need to make a five by five cube around the center. <coughs> yeah. Excuse a moi. How do I, how does one, oh, well, I guess it doesn't, wait a second, actually I could figure this out pretty easily, couldn't I, by going, uh, what, wait, I would go, one, two, three, four, five, right, and then, I'm just, I'm just trying to work my life out right now, <laughs> but yeah, so my sister's in the hospital, they took blood from her, um, they're keeping her overnight, is it, is this wrong, this is wrong, oh man, Wait, what? How did I done goof this up? One, two, three, four, five. Does it have to be like this? All right, hold on. I'm gonna pause this for a second because I need to figure out exactly what's going on. And I'm, I was getting millions of texts, so I should probably respond to those. So be right back. Okay, I think I worked out my issue, and my issue was that I needed a tissue. Yuck, yuck. No, seriously. I don't know why. Why are you here, Roman? I know, like, you're a freaking gosh dying horse, but you're crazy. You're crazy, Roman. You're crazy. I don't know. I don't know how to use horses. I don't think I've ever used horses, guys. I don't know how do you how do you work. I think you press jump once to get on the the bottom screen, but it goes all weird. Do I have to hold it? Oh, I have to hold it. I see. 
Duh. You can't climb vines. What am I doing? You are a horse, not a monkey. You crazy, Roman. You crazy. You crazy horse. I don't know how I'm going to get her out here. I'll have to just construct like a ten freaking staircase of doom and destiny. But, uh, yeah. Uh, what was I talking about? My, my sister being in, uh, uh, jail. What? No, she's not in jail. That'd be bad. So, yeah, so I, I don't know. Um, they took her blood in there. They say she has a high blood or white blood cell count, which definitely is telling the doctors that there is, in fact, something going on. Yeah, they're keeping her overnight, and they're going to do an ultrasound on her in the morning, and then hopefully things will get settled, because if they aren't, that would suck. No, really, it would suck pretty bad. Uh, hmm, okay. So, okay, so. I don't want to do this now. Uh, well, this is the general shape I want to get. So the walls will be here, here. Here, here. Right. I think it was right so far. Yeah, and then the tower here. Great. Oh, my nose is so itchy. Ugh. <laughs> so, what this is going to be... This is essentially going to be a tower, guys. So, what this does is it stops people from just going out and immediately going, Oh, I'm going to shoot the guy across. Which is great, and also provide a strategic defensive position. And other crazy stuff. So, I mean, I guess we could start building it up. Uh, uh, my nose is so itchy. I don't know why my nose is so itchy all of a sudden. <laughs> it's not good to record episodes at 2.40 in the morning now, guys. Holy crap, why is it so late? I don't understand how clocks work. It's true, I don't. Ha ha. Um, <clears throat> I think on my world... Yeah, I just made it square on the out Yeah, I, I, I do make it square on the outside. I do this for a reason. Which will all become clear. It will all become clear. So, I'm honestly not too worried about her. Um, though, I, I, I think she'll be fine. If it is appendicitis, that is really, really bad if you don't catch it right away. Is, there, is that sign still down here? There, there was a sign down here, wasn't there? Sign? No? Okay, great. Uh, so I'm actually really happy though that my mom was, uh, we were with my mom and my mom was, uh, I'm really happy that my mom, my mom was in town. Mostly because if she wasn't, um, it probably would have went a lot worse because my dad is in Mexico right now. He went on a trip to Mexico and due to that, it's just been me and my sister here at home. So if my good old daddy -o wasn't home. Or since my good old daddy -o wasn't home, um, I don't know if my sister would have came to me or not. If it wasn't for the fact we were all in the small hotel room playing Mario Kart, that uh, if she didn't like, yeah, if like if if my mom wasn't there and it was very clear she, something was very wrong, I actually do not think. Well, I, I guess I can't really say I don't think, but I don't really know if she would have actually came to me or not. Which is, I mean, that's kind of scary to think about because, I mean, but then again, she would have been in so much pain. I guess you would. I mean, you'd have to think she would have to, right? Because, I mean, there's only so much pain someone could take before they go, okay, I should probably go to the hospital, especially like, my sister, because she's kind of a wuss. <laughs> Alright. Okay. So. Yeah, so, I, I mean, it was really good that... My sister actually did say, my mom asked her what she would have done if she wasn't there. And she did say she would have called me. But, I don't know, man. I don't know. It's entirely possible that she wouldn't have, and she's just a big fat phony. Alright, I want to build this. One, two, three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Lay them straight. Nine, ten. Do them again. What? So yeah, uh, I'm sure maybe I will give an update in the text form on the video, on this video, like right meow, explaining what's, what happens. Okay, I wanted to make sure I wasn't using my, um, my silk touch pick. I want to save that for important times. So I'm sure she's fine now, or she has, she might have to, I mean, I don't really know much about appendicitis, like, I didn't really know anything about it at all until... <clears throat> I, I looked it up after I found she was sick and she could potentially have that. 
Well, once again, that's all just speculation on people who aren't seeing her at a doctor's level part. So, I mean, she could very well just... I don't know, just have me fighting some kind of nasty, weird flu. Oh, crap, that was very bad. That was very, very bad, actually. Well... Yay, ladders! Makeshift ladders! I was actually very lucky I had those. <laughs> so, I, yeah, I'm sure we'll keep an update. I, the only thing I know from Appendix is, is that they're pretty useless... And no one really knows what they do. And Jack from Lost had to do surgery on himself to take his own, take his own appendix out. <laughs> so yeah, that's all I really know about them. So I mean, I guess we'll see in the coming days or tomorrow. Um, yeah, I, I guess that's really about it. About that. Um, I've been trying to keep up to the best of my ability to play every single day that uh i record every single day i should say that i don't or i i'm like home alone i don't do anything for the day and so far i've actually failed it <laughs> i was supposed to i was actually home last night but i didn't record mostly because i was up till 4 a.m practicing a race uh there's actually an upcoming race i don't know if i should really spoil it or not Hmm, maybe, I'm, maybe I won't spoil it, but I will tell you guys, there's an upcoming race on a future channel, hopefully, unless things go terrible, which, I mean, they actually kind of did. Um, well, more on that in a second. Actually, you know what, screw it, let's just talk about that now. <laughs> so, the race. Uh, we are racing a particular game, an interesting game, a game that everybody loves. This is a game that everybody loves. And, uh, um... We recorded, actually I practiced last night for this game for, I don't know, I probably started practicing around 12 a.m. Yeah, that sounds about right. And I practiced pretty freaking late. Uh, actually, I practiced till about 4 a.m. I think is when I called it quits. Oh man, I don't know what I do around these corners. Crap. Well, I guess we'll just start going around this way. Or I could just, I could just wing it and see what happens. Because I do know what my end result is supposed to look like on this tower. No. Don't do that. I wish, you could, I wish there was more st um, stair variations. I don't like the small amount of stair variations, you know. Alright, fine. I'm down here now. Oh <laughs> uh, Well, I guess that, there goes my ladder. But I guess it doesn't really matter. What the heck? Did I place that ladder by mistake? Um... Yeah, so I stay up super late, and then we recorded today, and it's actually a four-player race. So, whatever it is that, it's like, you know, unless, like, they're very veteran YouTubers and they know exactly what they're doing, I've noticed, like, you have to come to expect to have issues and have to, like, kind of embrace the fact that chances are you'll probably have to play through the game by yourself. Just because someone derped up the recording at some point. And I'm not saying it's any everyone's fault but my own. Because I've definitely had my own mistakes. Such as my memory card corrupting. Can you really call that a mistake on my end though? That's just kind of bad luck than anything else. But um. Yeah so. We recorded for a straight hour. And then found out one of the guys we're recording with. His recording software didn't record anything. And so. We spent like an hour trying to figure out, well, maybe it did record and we just don't know where it is. Because he actually did do a few test recordings. But the issue was that uh, it's a brand new, or he got an Elgato 60HD, which I have actually been looking at potentially getting. And what, why am I here? Why am I here? Why did I come here? I think I wanted stone slabs. Does that sound right? I don't know if that sounds right or not. Oh, I need torches as well. Um... Yeah, he got an Elgato 60HD, and he's kind of new at it, and he did, he actually did a practice run of the game, and then he uploaded it to YouTube, and, it, it, yeah, everything looked fine, his recording seemed to be working perfectly fine, ooh, I told you, that's why, that's why I'm here, that's one of the seven reasons why I'm here, uh, and yeah, his recording went fine, he did a few other little recordings, and everything worked out, and then we did the hour-long recording today, and it failed! It failed, it failed, whale. Ah. So, yeah, that, that sucked, but <laughs> whatever. I mean, yeah, stuff happens, and it's unfortunate that it happened, but, you know, whatever. <laughs>
we'll we'll just have to figure out how to well actually we're just gonna re record the race at a different date um but to be honest i was getting pretty sick of playing this game over and over i've actually uh been playing this particular game a lot like a freaking lot and i also started uh, what I'll do normally is if I want to let's play a game, but I don't want it spoiled to me, I won't watch anyone's playthrough of it on YouTube because, I mean, I guess you kind of got to do that to not have anything spoiled to you, right? So, I, um, I've, once I, I got far enough in this game and, um, I, I decided to start watching the Game Grumps playthrough of it a few days ago. So, I've been watching a lot of that. I've been, uh, you know, playing it myself, and then I'm practicing for this race, and needless to say, I'm getting pretty freaking sick of this game. <laughs> I mean, I'm still having fun with it, but at the same time, I was like, I just want a break, man. I need it. And so, yeah. I mean, as sad as I am, this happened, that we have to re-record, I mean, at least, like, we kind of all decided that perhaps we need a little break from this game. So, that race will still definitely happen in the near future, but for now, just kind of, it's just kind of there, sitting in the cart, sitting on the toilet, sitting on the toilet, and flush. Yeah. So, yeah, more on that eventually, or you guys will just actually probably just see it. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll mention it in a video, and maybe make my own promo video for it. I should do that. I'm really bad with that. A lot of times... I won't make, or if I'm on something or guest commentating on it, I won't, like, really state it on my own channel, which I really should. I should really do that, but, uh, I, I'm pretty bad at that. <laughs> Mostly due to, I just forget, and then it sucks. It's terrible. It's terrible news for everybody. Uh, oh, actually, I need those. Tanko, Tanko, Tanko. Alright, so that's pretty much a tower. It feels kind of short, though, doesn't it? Hmm. 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 Oh, you know what? It does. I was trying to figure out. It felt kind of small, but I know exactly why it feels small. Because it's as small as my pee pee. Uh. Okay, that was really annoying. Um. Yeah. So, yay! Potential race in the future. A oh, definite race in the future, I should say. Freaking Roman, get out of here! Saint your house. Sheesh! You just come here and you just live here. And it's like, come on, come on. I just don't know why I turned to Captain Falcon, but it, it was a thing. It was pretty great. Uh, yeah, so I guess you guys will eventually see the race, and it'll be fun times for everybody, including Yeo. Yeah, what else could I talk about? I mean, that's really all I... Okay, I don't want to have any vines on here, because I specifically wanted to leave this so no one can get up here. But the person... Oh, no! On the inside. The inside man. As, as it will burp something. Uh, yeah, let's place that there so that doesn't look too even, too even Steven. Ooh, I almost wonder if I shouldn't have vines there as well. You know, let's not do that. Yeah. I want them to have to walk all the way up the stairs. How could this happen to me? I wish there was a way to make vines not grow down. Like, I wish I could just place random vines on here and not have them grow down. I would prefer that with some things. People of the work at Minecraft, make it happen! Ha -ha. Oh no, I don't want you there, Mr. Vine. You are not going to make a vine video today. However, it might make parts of this build a little bare, to be honest. Oh, yeah, miss this, miss this area. Let's do that. And, yeah, that's it. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. And then, I'm just gonna break all that and pray that there's no issues here. Alright. Okay, this is actually the part where I didn't know. I don't know how to really make this tower so. Like, what I initially wanted to do. I should really continue eating, otherwise, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die, 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 die. Do, 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 do. Yeah, what I initially wanted to do was have this tower go straight up and then like anyone coming in from any side could actually climb the vine to the very top however because it's only a one wide hole I can't really do that I have to like do this or some crap <laughs> uh, I guess I need one more one more time I'll be okay yeah and then do this 
I mean, that's really the only way I could... Unless I want to make the tower bigger, but I don't really want to make the tower any bigger than it is. Espe Wait, what? Oh, okay, yeah, especially because, like, these stairs, when you go up, it they make it, like, perfectly to the middle. So, I don't want to make it... I wonder if I should make it bigger. I mean, it is kind of a pathetic tower, isn't it? That's actually a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be. Which is weird, because, you know, I made my creative world and it looked fine. <laughs> but, you know... Another thing I'm actually a little bit worried about here is, uh... These vines getting broken, because once they break, I mean, there's no way to really get up here. Yeah. So essentially, I want to have the... So you can come up here, but also people could walk up this as well. So they can, like, you know, Archer Tower! Bam, bam, bam! Shooting arrows and crap! Yeah! And then someone could sneak up above them and hit them off and go, No! I mean, it won't kill them, but it'll take up a large chunk of damage. Damn! Idge. <laughs> you thought I said a square word, but I didn't. I, I missed my shovel. Can I take that back? Can I go steal my own shovel back that I donated pointlessly? There was no point in donating that shovel. He doesn't want that crap shovel. <laughs> oh, man. Well, I guess it's too late now. Because, you know, it's too late to apologize and stuff as the song goes. And if it's too late to apologize, or if a song says it, surely it must be true. Who surely? I don't freaking know. Uh, let's make a shovel. 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 Oh, yeah, yeah. Making the shovel. Yeah. Alright. Um. What was I just talking about? I don't know. I don't actually, I don't remember. That's kind of annoying. I wish I was better at remembering what I was talking about. That would be pretty nice. Ha 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 ha. Alright. We're just gonna kind of spread this out a bit. I think this is why this looks so small right now. No! Don't block the door. I need it for door related things. Uh, okay, I'm gonna break this as well, actually. However, now it looks too... Not... Uh, natural, or something. Well, I guess it kinda does. This doesn't come out far enough, I don't think. Yeah, I like that. Yee! But I don't like that there's nothing... What, what just happened? What is this lag on my own server? What is this? People are gonna tell me MC Pro Host sucks or something. What is the madness going on in this world? <coughs> I don't freaking know. So I'm still a little bit sick, actually. It's really freaking obnoxious. Uh, okay, we'll do this. I, I'm I'm just tired. I'm sick of being sick, as they say. That that's a stupid thing to say. I mean, of course, you're sick of being sick. But it, that, I mean, that's that's why it's funny because you're sick of being sick. But it, it's a dumb joke. <laughs> it's a dumbo joke. Hey, there's the first one I broke. I found it. I found you, asshole. So, I'm getting pretty tired. <laughs> I do want to finish the tire before I end this episode, though. I'll just quickly dig out this area. I do want to at least do the perimeter around here. I also got to make sure it's lit up enough that creepers won't murder my face or the tower. Or just the arena in general, because I don't really want to rebuild stuff. That sounds like a terrible, terrible, terrible time. Alright, I think I dug all the dirt I want to. That's probably not true, let's face it. I hate the dirt. I'm a racist against dirt. If you're dirty, I probably hate you. Take a shower, you bum. I'm sorry. That's rude. I apologize to all the bums watching this. I guess that is... Like, I said that jokingly, but I guess that is possible now. If, like, you know, just internet cafes and such, right? Is that a thing people could do? I feel like that's a thing probably homeless people could do. That's a Chris yard. Yep. If you bottle up, you could sell it on eBay for negative 10 cents. That's right. You got to pay the person you sell it to. It's pretty sad. <coughs> Shipping and handling is separate as well. All right. Let's do that and that and that and that and that and that. Oh, yeah. You know, with the cattails. All right. Finish the arena. I'm listening. Jeez, man. You see that? Look at that pick. Wait. No, the sword. Finish the arena. Oh man, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Freaking hippo and your freaking bossy ass attitude. What the hell, man? I think you just boss me around. I'm trying to think of like a funny comment to say that, but nothing came to mind. <laughs> uh, I don't like how straight that looks. <coughs> Yay. Uh, that, that doesn't come up far enough now either. But now it looks too straight. The issues. They're bugging me. I must fix. Now this looks too straight as well. 
I'm going crazy. Hey, the roots stopped raining. <laughs> All right, how big? How does this look now? See, that looks. Well, it doesn't look tall enough, though. Wait, I wrote down how tall I. Yeah, it says eight. Let's see here. One, two, three. F well, what? Th no, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, it's eight blocks high. Hmm. I, I guess that's tall enough. I mean, let's see how high we get in here. I mean, how high does this need to go, right? I don't think this should need to go too much because especially I did kind of like try to proportion it so you're not going too much higher above the arena stand. Look at that freaking wooden flower over there. What the heck? <laughs> oh yeah, I was gonna place vines in here as well. I'm all holy crap! I'm out of vines. Now how will I make funny content on the internet? Oh wait, I'll use Twitter. Or something. I'm really exhausted, guys. <laughs> it's been a very long day. <sighs> I was going to talk about a childhood memory of mine. Should I do that? Should I do sleepy time, Chris? Yeah, I guess we could do that. So, as a children's, uh, me and my neighbors I've talked about in the past, um, we, we used to go into the back fields. Or, okay, actually, I should preface this by saying... I used to live in a small farmer's town, and I've actually said that multiple times. Why is, is this, is, are these vines dying or some crap? I don't know what's going on there, I'll have to keep an eye on that. Uh, I used to live in a, in a small farmer's town. I, I now live in a city. That's right, a city. But, um, in this farmer's town, I actually uh, lived right on the edge of town. And my neighbors were two girls, one named Danielle and one named Haley, right? And so, me, Danielle, Haley, and my sister, Sarah, we would go and explore the back fields behind, um, I don't know why I started this story. I'm, I'm done building this pretty much and I have nothing else to do. <laughs> I, don't know, actually, I guess there's a few things we could do here. Is it? Okay, it's nighttime. Great. I need some skeleton bones. Some spooky, scary skeletons. So yeah, we would always go <coughs> explore behind the um, houses. Oh, I should light that up right now. Yeah, let's go do that real quick. Let's go explore behind uh, in the fields. And we would pretty much find a whole bunch of old machinery. Farmers machinery that wasn't no, was no longer in use. Just kind of sat there and rusted. And then uh, we also found some like... Oh, this is pretty dark too, actually. <coughs> we also found, um, like, a few, like, knocked down buildings, I guess, there were barns at some point. There's a whole bunch. There's, like, a whole bunch of, like, wood sheds back there, and tool sheds, and old swathers, if you know what a swather is. While I'm down here, I should actually fix this up. Uh, just knock out all the stuff that isn't. Crap. God dang it. Is that going to turn to grass? Oh, I was going to say, that's totally going to turn to flint again, isn't it? But it didn't. And so, <clears throat> we found this tiny... Well, it wasn't tiny. It was about... Let's say... I want to say the entire thing was the size of a car. And I don't really know what it was. It, it looked like... Oh, I should probably actually do this like so. Yeah, it, it was about the size of a car. It was just an old piece of machinery. There was kind of like... I almost wish I could like put a picture up of a little sketch of what it looked like. Oh, I shouldn't waste my supplies there, you silly old billy. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, essentially it was like... Um, let's say it was rectangular in shape. And on the front of it, there was like... I'm, I'm using my hands to explain it as if you guys can see it, but it's helped me visualize it better. On the front of it, there was like, it looked like there was like a car engine kind of thing, or just, I guess just an engine, does not necessarily a car engine, and I think there was a steering wheel and all that, and uh, so we did all like the machinery in the front, or the parts on the front I guess, were all like very vehicle-like I suppose, and then on the back, it was just kind of a bit more machinery, but on both sides of it, there was just pretty much two poles connecting the top of it to each other, like the back to the front, 
And there was also like a bottom of it, it was metal. And essentially it was the perfect thing that if we leaned like boards against it, we could make a clubhouse. And so that's what we did. Um, there was a barn like, I don't know, like 10 feet away. And so what we would do is we would... Okay, that works. Uh, uh, we, we, blah, blah, blah. What we would do is we would take these like giant boards from about 10 feet away. This was, this was a pretty big deal for like 10 year old Chris. Um, and we'd pull them over and then we'd kind of lean them against it and we started making this fort. And I don't know if I have any pictures. I, ah, oh, I, I don't want to say I'll find a picture and I'll put it here, but I don't think I'm going to be able to, sadly. You'll probably find the picture. It would probably be a lot of effort and I don't know how I'd really input it in this video. But, uh, yeah, so we started making a clubhouse. And, um, a few months later we actually discovered that... Whoa! Holy crap, that scared the hell out of me. Roman, what are you doing? Sheesh! No, you don't take any damage. That's good. I think I can make the jump. I think I can... <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, oh, you're a, you're a terrible jumper, Roman. Okay, never mind. I was going to say, do you think I can make the jump from the top of the tower to the edge of the arena? But I'll, I wasn't really going to do it for, you know, I don't want to kill Roman. <laughs> Pick up your horse, damn it! I actually got scared. I, I swung my potato and I totally thought I was going to hit her for a moment or him. Roman's a kind of a guy name, isn't it? I don't know why I'm thinking, but that horse just screams female to me. Female ejaculant. What? Um, but yeah, so what we discovered like months later is that the old barn that we were taking boards from and stacking against this little makeshift clubhouse that was very dangerous by the way there was nails all over the place and I don't know how no one died <laughs> uh, we discovered that actually I didn't discover my neighbor's parents discovered that we were doing this and they informed us that there's a bunch of coyotes I'll live under that shed so I don't know how I never like put it like, never realized this, and how we weren't, like, eaten, like, it still confuses me to this day, because coyotes are pretty vicious, and the fact that those assholes didn't get pissed at, what? oh, I was like, there's a missing block there, I thought, I thought I was looking at, like, a, that looks like a bow right there, I see I kind of, like, see I'm kind of outlining with my mouse, it looks like a bow, but no, I guess that's just the weird lighting stuff, alright, you, 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 there you go. So, yeah, coyotes, and, I mean, we heard about that, and then we decided to keep building it anyways, but, um, I really wish I could find a picture. One thing I really, really regret is, as we were building it, we started, we kind of stacked too many pieces of wood against it, and one of the supporting <laughs> poles I mentioned before that connects the back to the front it collapsed, or it didn't collapse, but it started cracking and it wasn't, it wasn't holding anymore, so it was really only another little piece holding on, and I didn't really want this, this, like, clubhouse to collapse on anyone, so what I decided to do was, I, we had a bit of an emergency, um, break button, as in, there was this little foot pedal kind of thing that if I jumped on it, it would kind of make the entire machine, um, I don't, I was going to say breathe, but not breathe. More like uh, it would flex it. And then you'd be able to flex it enough where it would shake the boards off. So I jumped on that and I pretty much destroyed our own floor. We seriously worked on for like two, three years. And yeah, it was really sad. And I that's I don't have many regrets in life, but that's definitely one of them. I would love to go there like one day and just, just explore that again. But I mean, I guess... I guess I can still. I mean, all the boards are probably still there. They're just probably sitting in the ground. Just just kind of chilling there, you know? Kind of chinchilling there. I actually saw a chinchilla today. I went to the pet store. Um, my girlfriend's been talking about wanting fish for a while, so I went out and bought her a fish tank and some fish supplies. And while we were there, this, this random lady came up to us that worked there, and she just had a chinchilla. And she's like, hey, this is my chinchilla. And I was like, okay, cool. Would you like to buy a chinchilla? What's the price? Freaking $300, and I'm pretty sure you actually need to buy chinchillas in pairs. I'm pretty sure they're social animals, and they they don't do t so swell if they're alone. 
So, I mean, yeah, if you want to chill, you have to spend like freaking $500 just on the pet itself. <laughs> or just on the pets themselves. But, yeah. So, uh, yeah, my f our fort. My fort. I was kind of like the lead guy that did everything. I was the oldest. With um, the neighbor, Danielle, she was a year younger than me. And then my sister's three years younger than me. And then her the other neighbor, Haley, she was one year younger than my sister. So, I mean, I don't know why that's really relevant. But, um, yeah, so we made, we made our best attempts to make other... We call this base camp, by the way. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's all I really had to say about that. Don't get eaten by coyotes, folks. Bad news bears. This will call an episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoy it, look at this. This tower looks so small and pathetic. Just like my wee wee. That's an episode. Thank you guys for watching. Goodbye. Ha ha ha.